Hey everybody. Uh, when I done my, uh, no more type of day four, let's type no more of day four, my Torchwood video. Uh, Untan, Mega's talking, he's like, man, you should do some more reviews. Well, I'm gonna try. Again, with one today, uh, -huh. Roger Corman's, uh, Death Race 2000. Now, they sort of remade this a year, maybe two years ago, with uh, Jason's Tatum and them. It's real serious. It is a mediocre movie. This is just, it's pure fucking camp. I mean, David Carradine, Sylvester Sloan, and all them. It's, it's a, it's kind of like Cannonball Run, but with death. It's a race across country, but you get points for killing grannies and all this shit. And, I mean, it's just, it's total camp blood sport. Uh, I really can't say much else besides that, that ruining in the whole movie. I mean, the 4B movie, in for its time, it's really good. I mean, it, you wouldn't know, you wouldn't imagine it being made in the 70s. Well, maybe you would, but a lot of people would. It's, it's worth a rental. I would buy it if you can find it cheap, but it's at least worth a rental. Uh, hope you enjoy. Here's another movie, uh, that I'm pretty sure you've probably never heard of. Frankenhook. It's about this guy, he works for the power company, but he's, uh, you know, he's an inventor and shit, and he's, uh, all time, and a part time doctor. Anyway, he invents, uh, this remote control lawnmower accidentally. <laughs> his fiance accidentally gets uh, chopped up by it. And, uh, he pretty much reconstructs him out of dead hookers that he kills with super crack. But it's it's not a trauma movie. But <laughs> it's uh what is his name? What is his name? Frank Hellenhoff. He also made uh, the Basket Case films and some other good memorable schlock movies like that. It's a trip, though. It's real fun to watch. Hope you enjoy. 